Hi and welcome to this DCP Word tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to remove a background from an image using GIMP. So let's open up a web browser and we're going to go to this Unsplash website and download this particular image. Now with this particular image, the background is quite a plain color you can see. It's like this blue color, it's got a few different shades in it, but it's just a flat sort of background color. And then the picture in front is like I've got a lot of contrast between the background and the foreground. So this type of image, we're going to be uh, removing the background from today. If you've got a different type of image where the background is quite complex with lots of different colors and so forth, then I'll put a link in the YouTube description. You want to follow that particular tutorial. So let's look at this particular image first. Let's download this picture. And on my desktop, I've got this folder. And we're just going to drag and drop that picture into this folder and we'll minimize this browser. Let's open up GIMP software. And we'll drag and drop the picture into GIMP and we'll click convert here. So we've got the picture in here. The first thing we do is right click on it and add an alpha channel. Then we're going to click down here and create a new layer. And that new layer, we're going to fill it with white background, white color here and click OK. Now this white is going to sit on the top. So we're going to drag that layer, left click, drag it so that it sits underneath the picture. Let's click on that picture itself. So let's click on the top picture and then we'll go to the select by color tool. We'll click on this tool here and then we'll click right down here in the bottom corner, somewhere around here. And that will select any of the blue color. Let's click on this image, click uh, here, somewhere like down here. So GIMP will go and find all of those blue shades and then we can just go to edit cut. It's gonna remove all of those blue shades and we'll click somewhere at the top here and click on the blue color at the top here and then we'll go to edit cut again and we've got rid of most of the blue so now we can just go to select none now you can see all of the blue has been removed we just need to tidy it up a little bit so let's click on the picture and we'll go to our erase tool and we've got the eraser here and we just increase the size of that and we'll pick sort of like this middle brush here this one here hardness 050 right this one right here and then we'll just go over the image with the erase tool. Make sure you don't go over the actual picture itself. Just go around the edges here. Like this. And that's our background pretty much removed. So we can test that now, just to make sure it's working correctly. So let's go to, um, let's minimize the browser for a minute. We'll go back to Unsplash website. And let's, to, let's see, let's go back to the main website. Let's click on textures and patterns here and we'll download a background right so let's download something that we can put into the background maybe let's use this image here so we'll click on this i'll put a link to this image in the youtube description as well so you can download this same image we'll click download free and we'll drag and drop that into the folder then we'll open up gimp software let's close down the browser now let's open up gimp again So over here, so we'll open up GIMP and we'll drag and drop this background image into the layer stack here. So let's drag and drop it into here and we'll click convert. And then we'll drag this white layer. We can just hide it or just drag it down one. And now we've got the background sitting here. We've got the girl cut out on this particular background. That's it, it's pretty much job done. That's how you go about removing a background from an image. It's not the best result i mean it's not perfect by any means but it's a quick job and if you just want to do a quick sort of job like this on an image and just remove the background quite fast uh, maybe you're doing this normally this sort of technique you might use if you're um doing images for an e-commerce shop so imagine if you're taking loads of photographs of product and you want to remove the background from it afterwards this is kind of a good technique to use because normally the background will be a white background or some sort of plain colored background um, and you just want to remove the background and replace it with something else possibly or you want to do a collage or some sort of Photoshop edit or not even Photoshop or GIMP edit using um, the GIMP tools here and today we actually use the select color by region right select it by a particular region or a particular color type so that's how you go about doing that let's go to file export and let's just export the image so let's do export as 
and we'll set it to a JPEG file. Let's set it to JPEG and we'll save it into the same directory. Let's call it dash zero one. Let's give it a different file name. Let's click export and we'll leave it at 90%. It's fine. We'll export it and we'll close that in GIMP now. We don't need to save it really. So inside of here, we should have the original image on this side and we'll take the new image and put it on this side. So you can see the background has been removed. There are a few issues in this image, like around the hair, you can see some of the blue still coming through. But as a, you know, just a rough example of how to do this using GIMP quite quickly, if you just want to do a basic example cutout, this is a good way to do that. If you've got an image with a much more complex background, then I'll put a link in the YouTube description on how to do more fine detail work, uh, removing the background. And that's the end of this tutorial. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and I look forward to seeing you on the next DCP web tutorial. Thank you.